very unconventional thinking, is it not, uh, in this market, um, that sharing ideas with the client at an early stage is a bad thing. Can you explain? Well, I think that what we've done is we've slipped into a point of view that says um, the best way to sell great work is to constantly include the client. Now, I, I am not in any way suggesting that I'm trying to keep somebody out. I think there are all kinds of things one should do to include the client, include the person who's commissioning that work. But tissue meetings aren't one of them. Because what I am trying to do is I'm trying to create from some intelligence, which is the strategic thinking, I'm trying to create a piece of magic. So you go into a tissue meeting, you've got um, sort of five or six ideas, this is the way it works, and the client and you all sit around and it's all wonderful and isn't it fantastic and we all feel part of it. And you talk about that, you talk about this, and then you walk away saying, we're going to concentrate on that. Well, who knows if that, that you've all decided on halfway through the process, is going to create the magic. It might be over there. And why do you invent a process that actually inhibits magic? if that is what you're trying to do. So I look at it and I go, this is completely stupid. And it was created, really, by agencies to kind of be more friendly to clients. Mm -hmm. Now, again, I'm not trying to say be unfriendly to clients, but the process of creativity is not easy. Coming up with great ideas is not easy. It's not everybody can do it. Getting clients to buy very, very different ideas is not always easy. But in the end, that's what they need. They need ideas that are going to transform their business.